Sun, Moon, Rising, and Leo's. It is the month of June 2017, and we're here with your energy vibration. This month of June is going to be the energy of the fire sign and has the energy of the chariot. The chariot covers the energy of the month of June for you. Uh, and this is going to be a wonderful, wonderful time. There are certain aspects, certain things that are happening in your life, which is very important that you should take note of. Um, please remember to listen to your general readings and the sun, moon, and rising sign have changed up the energy vibration of the reading. So at the end of the uh, reading, you can find energy vibration of the sun and moon rising sign. It is going to be a wonderful time. It's going to be a positive, wonderful time. And this positive, wonderful time is going to carry in the energy vibration of a lot of stuff coming in. And uh, uh, there's certain aspect. Um, the month is begin with the energy vibration of the hair. And it's going to change to water. There are five weeks in this month. For the people who works with the energy vibration um, of the Metatron is the angels who is working, the Ascendance Master who is working. So be aware of the situation and what is going on. As we look at the month, the five weeks is here. And what is happening is that in the first week, I'm going to get my glasses. And the first week, the aspect that is going on here is that you have the energy vibration of the devil. Your energy vibration is the energy vibration of the devil. The devil is here and it's going to help you guys um, to deal with significant situation in your life. And with this energy of the devil, it's going to bring you in the first week. The first week is going to be the energy of the hurt energy. It's going to bring you um, clarity clarity to certain situation and the clarity to certain situation is going to bring the energy of death to the situation so be aware of what is happening and understand that um, the clarity that is coming in is going to change your whole outlook and the whole energy vibration it's going to bring stability but yet still it's going to bring a hand to certain situation that was going on okay so for the women, if there was an um, unjust situation that has been going on, things that was happening with you and your friend, fr girlfriends or um, partner or that sort of a thing or an, an, an situation that was going on, it, it's going to bring end to these situation. Okay. The number that you have, two and six, uh, um, that is eight and three. Three and eight is eleven. There is a portal opening up in the first week of this month for you people. So it's an Earth week and it's a balance week. With the Earth, um, the number eleven sign is always the energy vibration of uh, um, um, uh, uh, um, duality, but yet still with the number two energies, spirituality, information, connection with the universal angels. So as we look at the second week, you have the energy of uh, um, the the tower bring in the energy of the night of uh, um ones the night of ones energy is the energy vibration of the younger energy vibration of um 18 to 20 something it can also be an older person with a younger energy vibration this is going to be um you are advancing in your life you're moving up you are um, being understanding you're accepting certain aspects and certain things of life and you are trying to bring positive energy to certain aspect of yourself this is extremely good for the men the second week is going to be a promising week for the men um you're going to be very adventurous and you're going to be very ambitious going forward in your life and moving forward in certain aspects and certain things of your life so it's it's going to be a very wonderful week for you guys um, the energy vibration is 10 and one another 11 so there's something happening for you um, Leo's in um, this month because it's the first week and the second week that the number 11 you have which is a portal opening up which is a connection with um, different worlds different um, beams that sort of a thing that sort of a, um, energy of the portal which is information coming through as we look at the third week we have the energy of um, justice bringing the five of swords in reverse um, another fire sign of got this so 
whatever conflicts you um, people have there is now a balance you are bringing a balance to a conflict in situation if you had a lawsuit and that sort of a thing a balance is coming in and the five of swords is in reverse a lot of you five people are having this and it has to do with the energy of the devil removing all these obstacles and these blocks that was there in these conflicts so an end is coming to it and there is balance coming in your life so this is really a wonderful energy uh, five and five is ten forty um, so it's a sense of achievement for some people but it's a sense of stable and balance um, it's, a, it's a time in this week for resting after a situation what you have been going through it is the end of certain aspect and certain situation so you are moving away from certain negativity in your life so you have the energy vibration of the number four in the third week in the fourth week you have the energy of the fool moving away from certain situation in your life which is wonderful and you're going on a new journey and this new journey is going to bring you luck luck and success is going to come true um, there is no fondling in the fourth week because uh, the energy vibration of uh, um, success and good wishes uh, luck uh, um, a promising of a new day of a new of something new because you're moving away from certain aspects and certain things which is very very good in your life and this is going to help a lot for you Leo's because you're going to see a transformation you going on a new journey and this sort of a thing is going to bring um, equilibrium to you as a person as we move on and we go to um, your number is going to be um, the number two energy so there's a lot of duality there's a lot of two the first week second week and the fourth week you have another two energies was 11 11 um, 8 and another and, and two as we look at your fifth week the energy of strength and this is so strange the energy of strength comes with the number nine energy I've never seen this before so the energy of strength is here and this is uh, um, very important for you Leo's um, there you are fighting with the lion or there's an uh, another uh, or uh, so whatsoever is happening you Leo's need to find inner strength because there's a block there is a block and you need to find the inner strength to um, surmount over the block and this is going to be extremely good once you can sur surmount over the block because this is a, a, um, a situation that is coming from a lifetime before and you need to overcome these obstacles and and this beast that you're fighting and it can be in a lake but it can be out like uh, some people it's going to affect in a lake some people it's going to affect out lake but it is this energy is for the men in the fourth week uh, you are going to have uh, um, a blockage uh, obstacles uh, um, that is there but acts the energy vibration to help you to remove all these obstacles and by removing these obstacles the chariot will come in to move you forward in your life and in certain aspect of your life so you know the blockages is here and it's like it's blocked because the water side is to the for the first couple of weeks and then and it's all about the men in this week um, uh, the, the love there is uh, in, in, in this month the love uh, um, is in the second week uh, that's where you can find love in the second week the energy vibration of love is in the second week uh, so as we look at the energy of love in the second week uh, for the men it's going to be a powerful time to find a partner it's going to open up a lot of energies um, because you're moving with ambition uh, at the end of a relationship was in the week before and now you're moving out to something which is so much better for you 
and yet still um, in the the fifth week the last and fifth week because it's the energy vibration of uh, um, the wheel of fortune bringing you a situation that you have to stand strong against and this you're going to overcome you're going to overcome all the obstacles that are um, is in your life um, an ending is going to come to a lot of thing and cleansing it's it, this month of an effect on the masculine people the the men um, it can be also women who has this masculine feeling but the women are not going to feel it that much as the men the first week is going to have, have an effect on the women and the sec the third week but for the rest of the month um, the energy vibration for the men this is where the problem is going to come in as we look at the sunrise in Leo's what is going to affect you and um, who is going to affect you you have the energy of uh, the Capricorns coming in so um, for the Sun rise in Leo's the energy of the Capricorns are coming in and you have to deal with a situation with the Capricorns and this uh, situation have to do with Saturn Saturn so it's as if Saturn is coming in to awaken you and the Capricorns are going to come in to work with you together with Saturn the energy vibration of Saturn to release that which no longer serve you because the first two weeks is all about to receive three weeks the first three weeks is all about releasing certain aspect of yourself that uh, and certain things and moving away from things uh, that are not vibrating on high energy vibration so be aware of the situation understand where you are and where um, on what you're about to do to understand what is the next journey that is you you need to go forward with as we look at the Sun uh, the moon rising sign for the Leo's we are going to have the energy vibration of the Aquarians so there is going to be a lot of Aquarians affecting your life um, in the month of June um, there are certain aspects and certain things that you have need to work out with these Aquarians and they're coming in with the energy vibration of Pluto and as you know what Pluto has to offer it is always Pluto is there and is a, an aggressive so these Aquarians are coming in at you with um, aggressiveness and you need to understand where you are and understand what sense of the journey need to be aware and how you can clear this energy so this is wonderful so for the moon rising sign and that sort of a thing you're going to see some um, sort of a um, new energy um, sense is coming in and what is going to happen is that you are going to choose not to vibrate with certain aspect and not to vibrate with certain things in your life we're using the last and final card the vortex and it says I will not try to control the uh, the, the uncontrollable I will not try to control the uncontrollable we want you to match the place where you are and 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 will not just willingly determinate not just determination of the you need to control you need not to control the uncontrollable like what um, anybody else is doing and giving your um, embellishment attention to the only thing you can continue to have I have dedicated that I am going to take life as it comes and I am going to direct the lives that I have I can go with no tender and not what is allowed to me okay so this is extremely good because this energy vibration is one of the most beautiful beautiful energy vibration these are from the vibrational card um, I find them to be extremely wonderful they give so much powerful energy that is coming out and I'll be working with them more um, to let you understand your energy vibration so again I'm leaving you with this message I will not try or say it you will not try to control the uncontrollable okay and I want to say namaste until next month